That was the lamest argument I've ever heard. What was wrong with it? I'm not sure. It just seems so illogical. I've heard that argument a million times. Didn't you take that logic course from Homeschool Connections? Yeah, but sometimes when you hear a real-life argument, it's hard to tell why it's illogical. People don't speak in formal syllogisms. I think I know just the thing for you. I was just reading in the catalog that Homeschool Connections is offering an advanced logic course. One of the things you learn in it is how to take an informal argument, translate it into a formal syllogism so that you can identify it or figure out what the logical fallacy is. Oh, I think I have the book right here. This looks neat. Let's go sign up. That was the lamest argument I've ever heard. What was wrong with it? Well, if you break down the polysyllogism, you find that the third argument is based on an invalid first figure syllogism because it's AIE. Here's the formal syllogism. All adults have a right to autonomy. Carl. argument I've ever heard. <laughs> Controversy at the Olympics. That was the lamest argument I've ever heard. What was wrong with it? Well, if you break down the, uh, the polysyllogism, you find that the third argument is based on an invalid first form syllogism. Because it's AIE. Here's the formal syllogism. All adults have a right to autonomy. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm.